What is the pH of a solution made by adding 0.40 moles of acetic acid and 0.40 moles of sodium acetate to enough water to make 1 liter of solution? So we are also given here the Ka of acetic acid, which is 1.8 times 10 to the negative 5. So as you can see in this problem, we are given acetic acid, which is a weak acid, and sodium acetate which is the conjugate base of acetic acid. So a mixture of weak acid and a conjugate base makes a buffer. So in this problem, this is a buffer solution. And how do we solve the pH of a buffer solution? We use the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation. So the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation is pH equal to pKa plus log concentration of the conjugate base divided by the concentration of your weak acid. Okay, now let's start first with pKa. How do you get the pKa? So we know that pKa is equal to negative log of Ka. So that's negative log of 1.8 times 10 to the negative 5. So grab your calculator and solve negative log 1.8 times 10 to the negative 5. That's equal to 4.74. Okay, now let's solve for the concentration of our conjugate base. So how do you solve for concentration? Concentration is moles per liter. So in the problem, our conjugate base is acetate. We have 0 0.40 moles divided by how many liters of solution? 1.0 liters. So what is the concentration of our conjugate base? 0.40 molar. We'll do the same thing with our weak acid. So that's moles per liter. So in the problem, we are given 0.40 moles divided by 1 liter. So that's also 0 0.40 molar. Now that we have the pKa and our concentrations, we can now go back to the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation. So that's pH equal to pKa is 4.74 plus log. Our concentration of conjugate base is 0.40 molar divided by the concentration of our acid is 0.40 molar. And what's 0.40 divided by 0.40? That's 1. So pH is equal to 4.74 plus log of 1. And grab your calculator. What is log of 1? Log of 1 is just equal to 0. So log of 1 is just equal to 0. So... The pH is equal to 4.74. So this is the answer to the question.